Tommy Salvaro, along with the director of special events, Earl Williams, to handicap tonight's card. Earl, who do you like in the first race? Well, Tony, I have to go with the three horse. And who is that? The Dancing Senor. I like Dancing Senor. Okay. In the first race, I'm going to take maybe somewhat of a price. Number six with La Laverne Hostetler, and that, of course, is that pacing mare, so as I remember her name. Number six, Rocky Reed. If Rocky Reed gets to the front, she may win it for Laverne Hostetler. In the second row. I like Anthony, the three horse. Okay. Great driver and Jim Dolby, of Anthony course. Anthony gave a lot of money for this horse. Okay. I'll also take number three, Anthony, and driver Jim Dolby, perhaps to go wire to wire. The third race. I like Gay Surprise along with Chick Chi Town Hooker. I think Chi Town Hooker will win. Okay. And I would bet a 5 3 5 1 Fanella. Okay. In the third race, I'm going to take three horses in a box. We're taking number two, Sally's Danny Boy with Tony Grivers. Hopefully, he gets to the front and never looks back. In the same race, number four, Royal Reform. And number five, Chi Town Hooker. I'm taking two, four, five in the third. In the fourth race, Tony, I think the eight horse will win. Sherrod Turner. Okay. And Villa Monte should be second. If I was going to bet a Quinella, I would bet an eight, five Quinella. All right. We'll remind the fans also on these races. They're all Quinella Perfecta races, of course, uh, beside the seventh race. In the fourth race, we're taking number two, Ashlawn's Girl and Don Brooks. Number three, Arcadia Luke and driver Carl Purcelli. Carl Purcelli, great driver, always here at Maywood Park. In the same race, number six, Pinkafeld. Watch if Pinkafeld gets the front end. She may not want to give it up. Fifth race, Tony, this is my special. Okay. My boss was asking me tonight, Earl, what's the blue plate special? This is the blue plate special. Okay. Handy Skipper. All right. I think Handy Skipper will win the fifth race. Okay. No All right. Now, you know, in this fifth race, it's an excellent field. And, of course, perhaps the horse that's tons the best in there would be Lensometer and driver Laverne Hostetler. Laverne was hot last night. He had three wins. And when Laverne Hostetler gets hot, he normally makes it a big weekend, especially if he starts out on a Friday. I'm going to take two horses in there. I'm taking number five, Lensometer. Watch for Fast Fiddle and driver Marshall Duncan. Marshall's a good little driver. Fast Fiddle likes this racetrack. It could be a 2-5 or 5-2 in the fifth. Six race, Egyptian Luck should win, Tony. I can't say I really like this horse, but he should win. But I'm going to bet Brett's in Scotch. Bet Brett's R. Scotch. Okay. I'll make a Quinella 5 1. Brett's R. Scotch along with Egyptian Luck. Okay. Should be the Quinella. I'm going to agree with you. I like Brett R. Scotch. He won real nice last week in 159. Egyptian Luck doesn't like to beat, beat horses. He'll drive right next to them, won't want to pass them up. He has to uh, improve on that before he can beat anybody here at Baywood Park. But he is the class on the race. We're taking five Red R. Scotch with number one Egyptian Luck. So we agreed on that. We we've agreed so far. Now, here comes the seventh race, Tony. I, I looked at this race twice today, and I only seen one horse in here. If this horse gets a decent trip, I think Lake Hill Grandpa should win. Okay, Lake Hills Grandpa does have early speed, which will come in handy here at Maywood Park. Absolutely. He paced in 158 here last year at Maywood Park. 158 will, of course, win this race. Yes. Who do you like? It? I like uh, that same horse, of course, number one, Lake Hills Grandpa. Watch for Lomont Valor and driver Gary Leonard. Wiggles is a very fine driver. This, ho this stable, the Leonard Stables, always send their horses out sharp. Perhaps one of the best stables in all of Illinois, the Leonard Stables. I should know they used to train for me. Believe it or not, I had that was my second choice. Okay. I like that horse a bit too. Now here come another good horse that I think should win. Okay. As a matter of fact, I would bet this horse tonight. But you don't. I don't bet. Okay. I would bet this horse tonight. I like this horse. Don't worry, Mom. Okay. Uh, the post position is not the greatest. But mm -hmm. This horse get a decent trip. This horse should win. You know what horse can give him a lot of trouble in that eighth race? Number one, Lord Nui. Good driver. Your buddy, Bobby Williams yes. Jr. Raised him. Uh, right. You raised him. Yes. And uh, not really, folks. But anyway, Bob Williams Jr. is a very fine driver. Lord Nui may try to go to the front, and if he gets the front end, he may ruin the chances of a very fine horse in the race. Number six, Maple Delcam, who should be the odds-on favorite. Very good pick. Okay. Ninth race. Okay, ninth race. Moving right along. Got, as you know, I got the star in the big circle. Boy, you should see this book. There's a big circle He's got here. everything circled, stars, cinches, Here's everything marked. Here's the best marked. Quinella bet His of best night bet. of tonight. Okay. Two, four. Maiden Skipper and Skipper Rain Inn, I think, is a solid <clears throat> for Quinella. Maiden Skipper 
Again, Carl Purcelli may have a good night. You know, Carl always has his friends out on Saturday night, maybe like to show off a little bit. <laughs> he does very well on Saturday night. Very know, fine driver. He is a nice little driver. Okay. Carl, I mean, take nothing from him. He is a nice little driver. Now the big race, the trifecta 10th race. No problem. Okay. Earl's got it. Four numbers. Key the two horse. Key the two horse. I take the two horse on top of the four, five, and seven. Okay. Racy, the two rusty. horse should win. Okay. 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 My trifecta tonight will be two, four, seven. So that's Racy Rusty, second image, and Ollie Wright. Right. Okay, I think you're right. I like those same numbers. Earl, before we wrap it up, we have to wrap it up quickly. You know, yesterday at Sportsman's Park, a racing fan won over $29,000 in the Millionaire Super Bet. Yes. And I know you know a lot about that. The yes. fan was very happy. Yes. You know, Maywood Park will want you to do the same thing. Tonight, we're starting out with $19,757.25. Now, if that goes according to the way it should go, it should be $25,000 tonight total for just $2 selection. If you used Earl's and my selections, naturally, you won't hit it, but if you use your own, chances are you could go home a big winner here at Maywood Park. Let me add one little thing, Tone. Okay. This can be hit. Mm -hmm. The picks, the gimmick can be hit. Right. If you would box in the first race, box, take two boxes in the, first, in the seventh, two boxes in the eighth. Okay. And have enough live tickets. I'm sure someone would hit it. All right. Well, that's it for now. Back to the races, and uh, we'll see you next Saturday night. Good racing.